who is the MPAA? Because when I got my notes back after screening um, the kids, and they seemed very oddball to me. Such <laughs> as? Well, they picked two scenes to pick on. They were trying to be judicious. So one had to do with gay male porn, and the other had to Which do with... Which has been a much talked about scene. Yeah. yeah. And, it, you know, that one I could understand. They thought I, sh I should cut back on that because it was underage kids watching it. Did I could you? live with that. That's okay. like in the culture. Um, even though I didn't think it was gratuitous and I thought it was in context. And I think this issue of context is huge yeah. and grossly just dismissed when they're evaluating things. So that's one thing. I'm like, who are these knuckleheads? Mm. Um, it's very annoying to me. And then the other, you know, since they wanted probably to be fair and they didn't want to hear me gripe, was this straight sex scene. So it's Julianne Moore and Mark Ruffalo yeah. and they're... And it's done comedically. I mean, it's done far away, and it's just a sloppy, silly, you know, grope. And they didn't like how long I stayed on the sex position of Mark from behind Julianne. They thought that was um, going away from comedy and becoming gratuitous. Are we talking about so, the number of seconds, right? How many seconds was it, and how many seconds did they want? You know, I mean, it was funny, and it was a lead up into another thing. So that's, you know, the context issue of the actors are going through something, they're about to like, you know, finish their business and you kind of needed to be in that moment for that length. And so they were picking on that and we went back and forth and I kept, you know, lopping off frames and it's not enough and it's not good enough and they don't tell you exactly, so that's very cryptic and annoying. they don't censor you. <laughs> yes, they don't censor you, but yes. I heard that there's a really good um, kind of trick that people do. I'll tell you about it later no, off no, camera. No, 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 come on, you have to tell. No, 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 not on camera. That's no way. Our, that's that's like that's that's, that's, our that's the bathroom. That's not film. Um, I'm gonna employ that next time. So anyway, at a certain point, I just thought, you know what? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get all caught up in this. I'm not going back and forth. Like I gotta get this film out. And I just said, I'm gonna do it a different way. And I regret that I did that. I mean, it's fine. It still plays as comedy. I don't think it took away anything. All the beats are still there. But now when I look at it, I'm like, what, you know, was that lazy? Was I just under the gun too much? Did I have to like rush it to the next festival or whatever it was that I was just being pressed to do? Was my editor needing to get out of the room? Why did I, you know, buckle and what was it for? So now I look at the film and I think that's a bummer.